Yo, what's going on, everybody? It's Spectre here. Welcome back to another video. So today, I have an insane, insane unit showcase for you guys. But before we get into that, make sure to like, subscribe, and try to hit 1K in this next couple of months. It would mean the world to me. We're so close. We're like 300, uh, well, no, we're like 200 something subs away from 1K. So it'd mean the world to me if you guys hit the sub button. Please, please, please do that. It'd mean the world to me. Also, I have a Discord server. Link is in the description below. I have an amazing community. You guys should go join that. Anyways, let's get straight into this. So, I don't know how this happened. But I was spitting on a Diane banner, okay? I spent 5k gems with a single lucky potion, and I ended up getting something insane. Also, mind you, the tray on this unit, it, 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 I got it in one spin. Like, I, I clicked once and I got it. As you guys can see, I have a shiny divine Diane. Sadly, she's not the best unit, but it's still a really, really cool unit, especially the wings with the shiny. Oh, it just goes so well together. I got the shiny in 5k gems and I got divine in literally one spin, which is just insane to me. And we can finally evo her and then we're gonna go showcase her. So let's evolve her into Di Danny, into Diane creation. Or Diane kind of bad. She, she kind of bad. Oh, and we get the stat cubes. Let me just let me go reroll my metal knight real quick. Jesus, that's mid. Okay. But yeah, now we have this Diane. Oh my god, it's so sick. She doesn't do anything special, which sucks. I think she should shield break or stun. Um, it kind of just makes sense for her to stun or shield break. She has a giant ass hammer. Like, I literally don't know why she wouldn't uh, shield break or stun. It, it just makes sense, to be honest. Uh, is there any... Oh, I can uh, fuse her into some things. Okay, hold on. Yeah, let's get straight into the showcase. I finally loaded into the game. Also, I don't know if the audio is bugged in this video. My headphones did break recently, so I do need to get new ones. I'm using AirPods right now, but the funny thing about my AirPods is today, one of them kind of broke as well. So that's really annoying. But, oh my God, her AOE is huge, dude. She's doing 3K on placement July today with level 100, she'll be doing about 5K plus on placement. Also, let me just turn my effects on. Honestly, the Unisys update were very, very underwhelming in my opinion. They, none of them really do anything special, and they're all kind of mediocre in their own ways. Like, Meliodas is really good, and Bon is really good, but they still have stuff to them that like, makes them pretty bad. And for both of them, it's their AoE. Like, Meliodas' Circle AoE is terrible. And for some reason, Diane just doesn't do anything special, and I think she should, and no, it's not me coping. Alright, let's start low upgrading her. So upgrade 2, six, uh, almost 7k. Upgrade... Oh, this upgrade two. That was upgrade one. Upgrade three. And then upgrade four, she gets Rush Rock. Turns into a huge cone AoE. Dude, her range. She, al she already covers the entire map. What the hell? Like, bro, tell me that move doesn't look like it would break shields. Come on. But she just... She, she splits the earth and just makes a giant... Just like a giant eruption of rocks come out of the ground. Like, tell me that's not a shield-breaking move. Anyways, upgrade 7. She's gonna get pretty costly to upgrade, but her damage shoots up. Oh my god. I think I saw a video with no trait, and she was doing 252k uh, damage without a trait level 100, which is just insane to me. Alright, upgrade 8. She gets Earthquake, and this becomes the biggest circle AoE in the game, I'm pretty sure. That is a sick looking move. The, the, the cooldown is insane, though. Like, the cooldown is actually just insane but the move looks really cool and i think this is her last upgrade so she'll be doing about i don't know maybe almost 300k damage which is insanely good yeah she'll be doing almost 300k damage i think when i get her to level 100 her model looks sick uh is she gonna be meta for leaderboards or anything like that probably not she might be really good because of her AoE. Just look how big that circle AoE is. Like I said, I'm pretty sure that's the biggest one in the game. So this is only level 90. Let's give her a Sakura buff real quick after she does attack. So Sakura buff, she's doing 259k. Yeah, she'll definitely be doing over 300k with the Sakura buff. And then we'll just Erwin buff her real quick. So with Erwin buff, she's doing 324,433 damage, which is crazy. 
So yeah, she's definitely a very, very, very good character. Is she meta? Um, no. Is she really good? Yes. If her SBA was definitely lower, and I might try, I'm definitely gonna get like a range decrease and a SBA down uh, curse. And maybe I'll try to get a really good stat on her as well, just so she's viable. But yeah, not bad at all. Anyways, I hope you guys did enjoy that video. If you did, make sure to like, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.